So we've all heard about the Miami Mall incident by now, right? How there were reports of eight to 10 foot creatures, alien-like beings that were appearing and disappearing in the mall and attacking people. <laughs> Now, as you've seen for yourself, that overwhelming police response. Story has gone viral recently of people claiming to have seen eight to 10 foot tall beings walking around at the Bayside Marketplace in Miami, Florida. Now, because of the widespread coverage of this incident, the Miami Police Department had to release a statement. And the statement that they released noted that the cause for this citywide three, which means every law enforcement officer within the city was called to this location. They said that the reason that this happened was because of a teenage brawl. First, our response to that uh, big incident in Bayside Marketplace what happened was there was about 50 or more juveniles that were shooting fireworks at people. There was also some looting going on. So officers that were on that scene were having a little bit of trouble containing it. So they called what is called the Citywide 3, which every officer in the city responded. That's why you saw so much police presence for, for that call to contain that crowd. Now, there is now video going viral of 8 to 10 foot aliens walking around Bayside. It's actually just a person walking with a shadow. So I can confirm to you all here today right now that there are no aliens in Miami in Bayside Marketplace at the moment. At the moment. At the moment. So, a teenage bra is what caused a citywide three, every police officer in the city to be called to one location. Well, if you say so. Now, people who were at the scene, eyewitnesses who were a part of this experience in the mall said that the police department is lying. They are trying to cover up what took place. That the reports of eight to 10 foot creatures and alien like beings were true. Some people have come out and given testimonies to the things they've seen. And there is footage of a being that people are claiming to have been walking around taken from a helicopter. On New Year's Day, there was a massive police response in downtown Miami. More than 50 young people armed with sticks began fighting. Police say juveniles were also setting off fireworks, causing chaos. I was at the Miami Mall yesterday and the government is lying. There were no kids fighting. Everyone started panicking because these gray creatures were walking around. They didn't make any noises or sounds, but stared and watched you move. I tried to take a video, but every time I would try to, it would just bug out. They set a perimeter and wouldn't let anybody out or in unless they went through their photos. We were visited by aliens and the government is covering it up. They were about six to seven feet tall and walked very slowly. They could turn their head around completely and it seemed like they could change forms. Like they didn't have any bones and could bend their body in whatever way. No fingers or feet, just arms and legs. They could also seemingly teleport. They weren't walking around normally, but instead disappearing and then quickly reappearing somewhere else. Now, I'll leave it up to the viewer to use their own judgment and determine what is true and what is not true, what makes sense and what doesn't make sense. And I'm actually going to do another video where I go into depth about what these things are and what they're here to do. However, for now, I've obtained video footage that has been scrubbed and removed from the internet. She was there at the site when it happened and what she captured on her phone will blow your mind. Now, did you ever ask yourself, why would they appear and show up in a mall? Why would these eight to 10 foot creatures or aliens, which are actually demons, why would they show up in a mall? Well, I have reason to believe that they might've showed up in that mall by accident and they were actually trying to go somewhere else. This could very well be the case and I'm gonna share with you guys some information and some evidence that can point to this possibly being a fact. But there is absolutely no way I can share that information in those videos here on these public social media platforms. This is the type of stuff that gets people's accounts banned, restricted, blocked, and everything else. So you're gonna have to head over to my Patreon page where you can view the full and uncensored version of this video. I will leave the link in the description. I also leave the link right here. Head over right now and subscribe and let's finish this conversation. I'll see you all there. As always, God bless you and shalom.